All right then. Hey, uh, one more video this evening. This is another game I just recently got uh, for myself for Christmas. Um, when I first got this, I'm like, man, check this out. It's in a sleeve, right? Oh, man, you know, let's push this out. Man, I pushed and I pushed. And um, I was on the verge of, like, breaking or, or bending the cardboard here. And I'm like, why won't that push out? I'm looking for tape. I thought maybe there's tape covering it. But um, it ended up just doing that. So I felt quite foolish. Um, but I laughed at myself. That was funny. It's got a magnetic holder here on the, on the clasp. And you open it up. And here's the game. Um, you have... A bag of blue cubes and one brown long piece of wood maybe a road I'm not sure what that's supposed to represent you have a bag of uh, blue and red discs and a bag of red cubes and a couple of black cubes And a bag of six D6, three of each color, red and blue. There's also a deck of cards. I've not opened these. The backs look beautiful. Uh, looks like it's a two-part card. Uh, top part is for one player only and the bottom part is for the other player nice little rule book glossy paper short goes over the pieces that is a bridge this wooden piece here is a bridge it's going over the setup the map uh, gameplay the different phases of the game it goes into great detail here we're going over combat supply phase scoring and victory conditions Here's going over some more explanations of the cards. Uh, I always like when they add this. Because sometimes the cards uh, don't really... Well, you need a little bit further explanation. And glossy paper. But... Uh, hippies? Oh, Hippias. I'm sorry. Um, this is more card explanation, I guess. Hmm. All right. Nice. Nice rule book. I'm going to have to uh, read through this and then teach my son how to play or my brother. It looks like a really cool game. I heard a lot about it. Um, last but not least, here's the map. It's a fold-out board. You could set this out on a coffee table and play this game. Absolutely. I love these small. I love these games when they're small. But they have enough going on to keep you occupied and aren't just silly. Uh, it's hard to find those types of games, but I hope this is one. But here's a map. Am I holding this wrong? Yes, I am. It's supposed to be played this way. The um, red player plays on this side, and it looks like this may be a track for him. And the blue player has a uh, corresponding track over here. Um, the, here you have on the map the different cities or regions, the connections between them. I guess these are lines that you would attack through or lines of communication of some sort. 
Uh, there are naval units in the game. Uh, looks like there's there's probably port cities. Um, but this game looked like a lot of fun. So um, I'll let you know once we uh, play this a game or two. I'll tell you how it went. But it looks like a lot of fun. So it's not a push out. You don't push this out of a sleeve. It's a, it's a magnetic thing here on the side. So don't don't bend your cardboard up trying to push this thing out like I almost did. <laughs> but hey, thanks for watching, guys. Happy New Year.